Hi students, welcome back. In this tutorial, we're going to discuss the difference between subscript and superscript on how to use it. Now, as you can see here from this example, here we have the element for water, which is H2O, and this is a subscript example. In other words, the little two over here is smaller than the rest of the text. All right, so this is a subscript. It's below the text. And here we have superscript. In other words, it's super small. <laughs> so here we have the normal text. And then we have, for example, a registered trademark symbol, which is the little R here, but it's slightly hanging in the air behind the word, which is a superscript. So I suppose you can remember that as Superman that's, that flies in the air. So a superscript is when something is hanging in the air behind something and the subscript sub meaning below like a subway, which is a train station on the ground, you would have that some a symbol or a letter or something is hanging just slightly below the rest of the text. All right, so how do you get it like that? If I type H normal size two and then O, how do I get the two to hang as a subscript? Well, you select the little two, and there's two ways that you can do that. You can either just simply use under the home tab, you can in the font group, you can either use the subscript and the superscript options over here, which is, I suppose, the easiest way. So I'm just going to select the subscript option, and as you can see, the little two became smaller. A similar way that you can do it, or a different way, is to always remember to first highlight what you want to change, or select what you want to change, and then you go into the font group itself, and under the font option, here yeah, you also have the option to use either superscript or subscript, in this case it's sub, and then you click OK, and the two becomes way smaller. Alright, so how do I do the the superscript all right same thing so if i type this out registered trademark all right and i and i insert the um that is a symbol and if i insert the symbol insert symbol and i go to more symbols it's not going to be under windings i'm just going to use normal text I'm going to try to find it over here. There it is. Click on insert. Close. All right. It's just behind the word, but it's not hanging in the air. So how am I going to get it to hang in the air like that? I'm going to select it. I'm going to go to home and I'm going to select superscript and it's going to slightly hover above or i could have just gone into the font group and then select superscript same same thing so if i zoom in so you guys can have a better look smaller number two which is a subscript and a hovering or a hanging um logo over here or symbol which is done as a superscript all right so that's subscript and superscript in one easy go thank you so much for watching